It could soon cost a lot more to house an airplane at Danville Regional Airport. City Councilman has proposed increasing the city's airplane tax to more than double the current rate in order to help restaurants and hotels. But as WSLS 10's Colter Anstead explains, other council members are concerned the tax increase would do more harm than good. Currently, anyone who houses their airplane at Danville Regional Airport pays a property tax of 30 cents for every $100 of the assessed value of the plane. Councilman Fred Shanks has proposed increasing that to 70 cents per $100 of the assessed value. I'm uh, opposed to the large increases in real estate tax that's being included in this budget and also the meals and lodging taxes. A 50 cent increase in the real estate tax and a 1 percent increase in the meals and lodging taxes have been proposed. Shanks believes the airplane tax should be increased in order to reduce these proposed increases. If we go with a 60 or 70 cent tax, which is twice the 30 cent tax, but more appropriate, I think that's not going to run off the customers. But Councilman Lee Vogler thinks the tax increase will cause people who currently house their planes at the airport to move them to a different airport. In fact, he received this letter in the mail last night from an airplane owner saying he will move if the tax is increased, and Vogler believes the owner is not alone. We'll lose the hangar fees also because they pay thousands of dollars each year in hangar fees, so it's a double loss. In the letter, the owner references the 90 cent rate, which was the original proposal, but Vogler believes that even with the proposed increase reduced to 70 cents, owners will still lose. Leave. The owner who wrote the letter says altogether he pays the city more than $11,000 a year. On top of that, Vogler says even at 90 cents, the city would only get an extra $15,000 a year. And if plane owners start to leave because of the increase, the amount of money the city would lose would quickly exceed that. In Danville, Colter Anstad to WSLS 10.